Fala pessoal, estou chegando aqui em Liverpool para ir a Anfield, último jogo do Liverpool antes de partir para o Qatar. Vamos conversar com os torcedores sobre o Mundial de Clube. Vamos lá. First of all, what, what does the Club World Cup mean to, to, to you as a Liverpool? What does, we need to be competing in that. We want to be known as the best club in the world. In a way, it's a bit of a novelty. If you know, I'm honest, but, but it's and it's a bit inconvenient with the fixtures, but it's something we want to win. I mean, then we can truly call ourselves world champions. You've got a squad. It's a squad game, so you should always take your best players everywhere. If if you want to win, if you really intend to win, you, you've got to take your best players. And these are super. Fit. These are the best athletes in the world, you know, and they should be fit enough to cope. If you're going to be the best, this is going to happen to you. So yeah, you should be prepared for that. And I think. Jurgen Klopp's got us more than prepared. And uh, we have a side from Brazil going to Qatar as well. Do you know much yeah. about it? Yeah, uh, they beat us 3-0 before, didn't they? <laughs> uh, years ago. It's a good test. And you might see some players you never heard of. So, but don't know loads. Obviously, just that they uh, just won the Copa Libertadores, didn't they? Is, is this game, 81 was the year yeah, that, that Flamengo I'm, I'm, Unfortunately, I'm old enough to remember that, okay? <laughs> What's okay. the memories of that? Um, been very disappointed because at the time I, I thought that there would be no club in the world that could beat us. Didn't really have the access to uh, foreign football like we do today, so really hadn't even heard of Flamengo. I knew Santos for, via Pelé, um, and when they beat us 3-0, uh, it shocked this place to the core. It really did. Yeah. In a way, if you face them again, it would be nice to win them because of that game. Uh, it's what you call unfinished business, I believe. <laughs> okay. What competition means to you as a, as a Liverpool fan? I think for me, it's, it's massive because it's a competition we've never won before. Um, so it's something that I really want to win. Yeah. It'd be really good to go out there and win it. It'd be a statement of intent, especially to Manchester City and any other team in the country that thinks that they could catch us this year that we can go to Qatar mid-season go out there and win the Club World Cup become the best team in the world uh, and then come back and I still think we can maintain our current form as well so yeah I think it's going to be great if we could become champions of the world as well as champions of Europe and as James said it'd be nice to be champions of England champions of Europe and champions of the world and just show the dominance of this Liverpool team and where we want to go in the future, I think it's going to be great for the players to get out there, something different. If you are aware of a Brazilian club going to play the Club World Cup as well, it's called Flamengo. Yeah. It's, what do you know about it? I don't know a lot. I know their fans are amazing. I've seen some of the stuff after they won the competition that got them there. And it's a lot like Liverpool fans. We're, we think we're the best fans in the world. You guys think you're the best fans in the world. And meeting in a Club World Cup, it just shows how big football is. I'm from Brazilian Tele, and yeah. there is a Brazilian club going yeah. to the World Cup as well called Flamengo. Yeah. Have, have you heard about it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard of Flamengo. Obviously, I know they're one of the better teams in Brazil. Um, but I think they will probably be uh, favourites on the day to beat them. Yeah. yeah, the only, only Brazilian team I've heard of is Santos because of Neymar. So, and Neymar's a class player. There is one thing that, because in Brazil, yeah. like, they would they would die to win this competition because yeah, really? it's an opportunity oh, to face a European side yeah, yeah, and win yeah. it's just like oh we are actually in the top of the world yeah um and in 81 it was yeah. Liverpool and Flamengo yeah, in the so finals I was, was going to say I know Liverpool lost to Flamengo in 81 when we won the Champions League for the, or the European Cup for the one of the first times um so I think obviously it would be good to for, as a Liverpool fan to win that competition, but obviously as a Flamengo fan, I have the ideal to beat Liverpool champions of the world, you know what I mean? Champions of Europe. So. Yeah.